so uh, what uh, what's been, what's happening here is we have uh, four acts planned. So one is uh, the Gautam is going to do a canopy. It's like a fusion canopy of Manitika, Kipimur and uh, herbs. And uh, Mr. Nadal is going to do the spaghetti with the vegetables and tomato sauce. You're going to toss up a fresh green salad and you're going to make your own, own dressing. And uh, Sunday she's going to do the crab suzet. So the, the crabs with the orange and flambing it with the with cognac. <laughs> Have you tasted it yet? No. <laughs> Would you like to taste and see if the seasoning is right? No. <laughs> How about your canopies, ma'am? Can we serve it now? Oh, she's, she's drizzling some olive oil. What is this? <laughs> <laughs> I think it looks like a dressing. Okay. Voila. Voila. Try it on. <laughs> we hope we can taste. This pasta by Mr. Nagar. Oh <laughs> and we got some fabulous uh, pani tikka. It's like a fusion canopy. Pani tikka can cucumber and fresh red chili. Yummy. <laughs> and, and there comes the salad. <laughs> So this is what happens in our Shushak Pukov. The judges are the contestants and the, the contestants are now in the position of judges. How does that taste? It's very good. I'll give you a straight pass for the final. <laughs> so what all? We've got some zucchini and mixed greens and yeah, olive oil and balsamic. The fast very nice, very fresh. Good. <laughs> so now you're going to taste what our Super Chef contest is going to be all about. A whole lot of fun. So please make sure you don't miss it. It will be a cracker of a competition and a fun evening to remember. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, again, thank you very much for being here. Uh, the Ladies Circle is an organization of young women from different walks of life, professionals, um, doctors, engineers, homemakers, that get together and do um, and take out a significant part of their time for community service. We are a part of Ladies Circle International and Ladies, Ladies Circle India. Madras Cosmopolitan Ladies Circle 38, which we are a part of, is an active uh, part of Ladies Circle India. And uh, we do fundraisers in different parts of the country. We are on the lookout for exciting, pulsating events to bring to you. And in the process, raise money for charity. Um, we have been looking on the lookout for something very exciting to do this year. Something current, something relevant. And we stumbled upon this idea of Super Chef Chennai to really tap into the uh, current mindset of competitive life cooking that seems to have taken over our collective mindsets. We have been lucky to have the support of very, very um, generous sponsors. We promise to bring to you a first of its kind event. Now, of course, has it been done like this in Chennai where you have such a comprehensive platform at, in which uh, we have invited applications, we have invited pre-cooked preliminaries, and then the final cook-off. I would like to welcome Ms. Tarla Dalal, who has now joined us, um, our esteemed, most esteemed uh, celebrity judge and respected uh, personality. Good evening, everybody. It's really great to be here. There is not just a table full, but I think a room full of heroes. And uh, I think it goes without saying that I'm very proud to be a part of this endeavor. And uh, I know Chitra for a long time. She's one of my heroes. And whatever little bit I think each one of us can do, we must. Coming to the question of a cook-off, 
what do I have to do with this event? Absolutely nothing. But I am fortunate in that there is a certain kind of a visibility that is attached to people who are known to the public. And what I'm trying to say here is it's not about stardom. If I know X number of people, every one of you out there, and I would like the media and the press to also stress on this, every one of you who has even 10 friends, and each one of those people know another 10 people, all you have to do is spread the word. So many of the health issues, the illnesses that we're living with, that we take for granted as a lifestyle issue, or it's an epidemic, or a pandemic, or whatever, so many of these are preventable. Either uh, by living carefully, by living responsibly, by treating ourselves with care and with respect, there are so many ways in which we can do this and uh, the first line of defense is in spreading the word and in spreading awareness and sharing of ourselves at least in that, in that little bit of time and that effort and that caring that we can give and every little bit adds up and uh, society is in a great position right now with the kind of awareness that has been created for issues like cancer. And uh, with everybody doing a little bit, I know this is going to build up into something really wonderful and magnificent and do whatever we can to further the hand of individuals like this who are doing so much and giving so much of themselves. Once again, looking forward to having everybody there, having fun and uh, creating some really wonderful aromas in that room. Thank you very much. That Mahesh, he was the music director. He died of cancer. Uh, he wanted to do something for the Cancer Institute and particularly for children. So after he died, his uh, friends got together and started the Mahesh Memorial Trust. And then we uh, decided to do something for children. And we built a, shall I say, a hospital, a small hospital, William Cancer Institute for the children. So we support media, pediatric cancers. And we've come a long way from when it all started in 2003. Uh, today we have a big hospital which is extremely uh, run uh, well because of our efforts also. So we take care of a lot of the administrative uh, support over there. We support children with pediatric cancer. And we are in the process of setting up an ICU as long as, as with a place where they can get good food. In fact, this, uh, this competition is actually quite relevant because if there is any way we can develop some kind of a nice uh, high protein, some nice recipe for children who are recovering from cancer, so that would be really uh, helpful. And also it will make food exciting for them because usually they really lose all their appetite and they don't want to eat much. So I'm really grateful to the Ladies Circle for doing this for us. And uh, we continue to uh, work towards that area, helping children with cancers. You must keep it in mind that these children come from extremely poor backgrounds. Most of them cannot even afford a simple blood test. And the families usually sell properties, sell whatever little they have to come and take treatment at the Cancer Institute. So we, tr we try and do as much as we can. And we are grateful that we have the support of people like the Lady Circle and the Park. and. And Gautami is a great supporter as well. So thank you so much. And we hope you will help us to continue with our endeavor in management of interest. Thank you. I'm glad I'm invited for a local cause. And uh, you know, something like that, we do it in Mumbai. Uh, for the, we have a Nair Hospital, there is a social, social department. So where we uh, gather the medicine for the diabetic people and asthma people. What happens to diabetes is a big problem. Mothers say, if I don't have money to eat, where am I to get expensive medicine for diabetic people? And uh, like that, the same way it goes with asthma. So like this, I've seen in many places, ladies are coming up and trying to do this type of a work. It's a great thing. Then all the big companies, you know, Zipla and other companies, they said, come on, you're giving us some money, we will do it. 
So like that, you know, it does, uh, ladies have started working. Congratulations and thank you for watching.